Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, thank you so much for joining us. I'm Lars with Jaspie's Hockeyland. And big congrats to nice guy Mitch getting on his first break ever. This break is the final vault. It's break number seven. We were hoping to do it as a hit draft, but three of the guys um, aren't in the room right now. So we're going to do it as a random hit as opposed to the hit draft. Uh, but hopefully the next one we can do is a hit draft because that is a lot of fun to do it that way. Okay, so the way it's going to work with a random hit is I'm going to randomize all of your names. This is the box, by the way. Box number three was selected by everybody in the room that was watching it live. So that's the box we're going to do. There are ten hits in the box. Everyone's going to get a hit. I am going to randomize these ten names. And a big thank you to Alan, Brad, Don, Yonar, Rudy, Paul, which is actually Mitch. Paul's his dad. Rick, Craig, and Mark in the final two spots. Last spot, Mojo. I'm going to roll these dice right here. Two dice. I'm going to randomize this list of names. And then the order of the names I'm going to put into this spreadsheet and print it out. And then as the hits come out, the first hit goes to the name at the top. Second hit goes to the second name. Third and so forth. And I'll write the names in on the sheet. And that's how we'll do it. Were it a hit draft then those names would be, those 10 names would be the draft order. We would break all of them. You could see all of the products and then select when your draft pick came up. But since we are missing like three guys in the room, um, we'll do it as a random hit instead. All right, it's going to be fun. Either way, we slice it. Best of luck to all of you. Let's roll these dice. And we've got a five and a three. That is eight. We're going to go eight times. Randomize this list eight times. That's one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, and last time, number eight. So this is the order. Rudy Ruiz wishing it was a hit draft because he would be the first draft pick right at the top. But Rudy, you're going to get the first card coming out. So let's insert it right there. <laughs> Rick says, say wow when you pull my card regardless if it's good or bad. We will uh, we will pull yours with with enthusiasm. All right. So those are the ten names. There are the ten names for you. So I'm going to print out these ten names and then I'm going to write in by hand the hits that you get. That's how we'll uh, make it work. Cool, everybody. Best of luck with the hits that you get. I love the hits that you get. I'm just, I'm just ready to begin. All right, let's do it, my friends. It is breaking time. You see your names. You see the order. Let's break this bad boy. Woo! I'm fired up. I'm ready. Let's get into it. Here we go. Mitch with his inaugural break. The final vault. So apparently this is in the game presents uh, basically what they had in the vault. Oh man, should we do it this way? Can you handle the tension? Can you handle the excitement? Bum, bum, bum. Okay, here we go. There's the case. Here are the cards. Oh, the drama, guys. The drama. Good stuff. Jenny from the block. <laughs> here we are. All right, guys, I will I will say who is up next, and then we will reveal their card. So up first, here's the, uh, the list of names, by the way, in case you didn't see it before. Rudy Ruiz, then we got Craig, Brad, Rick, Yonar, Mark, Don, Mark again, Alan, and Paul. That is Mitch. There you go, Mitch. I'm putting you in parens, buddy. First break, first break. And actually, Mitch, thank God, thank God, this isn't a case of uh, of the draft pick because you would have drafted last. So this actually works out better for you. You'll get the last card as opposed to the last pick in the draft. All right, here we go. Coming up. First up is Rudy. Rudy, your card is the mask. The mask number four from the vault. These are cool looking creative cards. We actually had a one of one the mask before. That is nice right there. The vault. The mask. Going out to Rudy Ruiz. The mask is going to you. And actually, 
Is that the sharks? What's on this mask? Oh, while playing with the Boston Bruins. I was hoping that would be the Sharks. I know, Jim Carrey card. All right, so that is the first card up. Up next. Up next, second card. This one is going out to Craig. Craig Stoops. Are you ready, Craig? Here we go. Mike Madano. One of one. We've got a Volt one of one. Mike Madano. That is awesome with the number 88. Draft prospects, draft year. Man, that looks good. It's fun to see the years in some of these from 2013 draft prospects. Bam. Mike Madano going out to Stoops. That is nice. Sweet. All right, so let's put that little sleeve for you, Stoops. Up next is going to be Bradley Pound for Pounds. Brad, are you back in the room yet to see this card live? Bradley Pound for Pounds is up next. Let's see what his card is. Alex Tangway for the Avalanche. And this is also a one of one. The final vault, one of one. Nice jersey there. Alex Tangway, game used jersey for Bradley Pounds. Yeah, it's interesting. There's kind of like a formula of the cards that they put in here. That is like the mask card always seems to be that first one up. Nice one. There we go. Oh, Jordan is back. Jordan, you are back just in time. Although, Jordan, are you in this? There's a Yonar Sebastian. But, Jordan, are you in this break? All right, up next, guys. This is going to Rick. Thomas, Rick, your card is Radic Foxa. Wow, but this is old school heroes and prospects. Game used jersey black, and it's a one of one as well. The final vault one of one. Radic Foxa, who's he playing with there? This must be like a minor league team that he's playing with. Top prospect jersey. 2011-2012. wonder what that team is. Anyone recognize that uniform? That's cool. Cool game used. All right, so Rick Thomas getting Radic. Foxa. Bam. Nice one, Rick. That's a sweet card. Oh, European League. Wow. OHL. That's sweet. All right, now we go to Yonar Sebastian. I'm not sure we've met Yonar Sebastian yet, but Yonar, this is your card. Autographed, Nick Ebert. Autograph here, Heroes and Prospects, Nick Ebert. Or Ebert, probably. That is going out to Yonar Sebastian. For the Spitfires. There's a minor league team for you, I'm guessing. Nick Ebert autograph. Nice one. There you go. Oh, now we do have Brad in the house. Brad, did you just join us? Did you see your card? Brad, here is your card out of that hit. We were hoping to do it as a hit draft, but then when we lost you and we lost, uh, we never had Yonar Sebastian, I guess. We lost you and then we lost somebody else. Allen. We couldn't find Allen. We decided we had to do it as a random. Oh, computer screen's messing up. That's what happened, I guess. Okay, so next up, Mark McCullough. One of his two hits. Mark McCullough. Another autograph. Authentic goalie graph. Sean Burke. Between the pipes. Sean Burke. An authentic goalie graph for Mark McCullough. Decades, and this is for the 1990s. Nice looking card right there. Nice. Oh, Yotes is in here as well, guys. Hey, we've got a good crew. Detroit Don, if you want to talk up your plans for enshrinement or enshrined, this might be a great chance to do it. Solid goalie right there says Detroit Don. Yeah, talk it up with the guys, and you'll get some others in enshrined as well. Here we go. This is Don Weller, Detroit Don Weller. Check it out, Daniel Alfredson. 
with a nice autograph on the car, Detroit Don. 2002, 2003, Signature X with an on-the-card autograph of Daniel Alfredson. And that is going out to Detroit Don. And Detroit Don loves him some Alfie, so that's sweet, man. That worked out well. Not bad getting a nice autograph card there for your spot. Got to love it. I know, oops. Oops, we were waiting on you, buddy. I mean, I was stalling as long as I could, but uh, yeah, we wanted to do it as draft pick, but unfortunately, you and Alan were nowhere to be found. So we had to do it this way so that you wouldn't be disappointed. So we actually did this for your benefit uh, in this format because we didn't think you'd be able to make a pick. So that's why we did it this way. All right, this one's going out to Mark McCullough, his second pick, Thomas Vukun. For the Czech Republic, Masked Men, Game Used Glove. How nice is that? How nice is that? Masked Men, Game Used Glove, and it's a Volt 1 of 1. Mark McCullough. Man, got the Sean Burke. And now got the Tomas Vokun from the Czech Republic. That's sweet. Okay, so... That is your two cards. Now we've got Alan Cohen. Alan Cohen. Coming up. And Alan, here's what you got. Is Alan in the room even? That was the other reason we couldn't do the live draft because Alan wasn't on with us. Alan, are you here? Here's what you got. Landon Ferraro. Heroes and Prospects. Landon Ferraro. That's a nice looking card. It's a one of one. Game used silver number. Landon Ferraro, Heroes and Prospects, Game Use, Silver, Number, and look at that, one, two, three, four. Four different colors on the patch. That is nice. Landon Ferraro. Going out to Alan Cohen. Alan, are you on? Are you on to see this live? We were trying to get a hold of you, Alan. Trying to get a hold of both of you guys. But there was no answer, so we had to go with the randomizer. And that is your card. Actually came up with a nice one. All right, final card, guys. Final card. And here we go. This is to going to Paul, who's actually Mitch. Mitch, this is your first break. The final card goes to Mitch, and it is an autograph for the Flames. Pat Quinn. Old school autograph. For the Flames. And that autograph is on the card. On the card for you, Mitch. From the vault. There you go, Mitch, my man. Getting in on Pat Quinn. Autograph on the card from the Flames. There you go, guys. Boom. Making it happen. Ladies and gentlemen, that is the final vault. Thank you so much, everyone. I am Lars, and I am out.